it's Memorial Day. Flags fill the cemeteries and mark gravestones of those who have served in the military in cemeteries all across our land. Decoration Day, my grandparents called it, because it was a tradition that on this day, families made the pilgrimage to visit grave sites, to adorn them with flowers, decorate them, and remember those who had gone before. For me, since I'm back in the area where I was born, it, it means uh, an annual visit to what was once a corner of my grandfather's farm visit to markers for four brothers, parents, grandparents, uncles and aunts, cousins, who've been laid to rest on that property which was once part of our family heritage. It's, it's a time for me to pause, to say a prayer of thankfulness and to remember who they were, what made them special to me. The writer to the Hebrews uses a quite different image as he speaks about those who have gone before us, but it fits today also. The writer to the Hebrews says, those who have gone before are a cloud of witnesses cheering us on, rooting for us as we travel this journey of life. There are advocates, there are encouragers. So whether you visit a gravesite today or just, just let the memory of the dear ones in your life flow through your consciousness. Yes, be thankful for all they meant to you. But in the hours of today, tomorrow, the next few weeks, the next few months, think of them as a cloud of witnesses cheering you on. This has been more from West Highlands United Methodist Church with a thought for your day. Just another way of reaching out. Thank you.